A beloved Scott County paramedic unexpectedly died this week after complications following childbirth. Her child survived, but she did not make it. WDRB's Molly Jett on how her co-workers, family and friends are remembering her. Molly. Devonna Shulin died on Tuesday at an, Indi at, an, at an Indianapolis hospital. Excuse me. She survived by her husband, Michael, and three children. She was Scott County EMS's unsung hero. We were a pair and we were a team. Devonna Shulin was Nick Olick's deputy director. I can't repay her enough. And friend. When people aren't mothers and they would visualize what they want to be during motherhood, it would be her. The 34-year-old died Tuesday in Indianapolis. Those children were her life. Shortly after giving birth to her third child, Maverick. Never seen so much, so many people come together so quickly. Police, fire, and EMS from all around Scott County. I mean, really, it was nothing so remarkable. Gathered to do a six-mile-long escort back to Scottsburg early Wednesday morning. Quite a display of community and uh, brotherhood among the, among the crew there. Nearly 80 emergency vehicles and 200 bystanders. The amount of support that she has is unreal. I knew, uh, I know a lot of people love her um but to see it with your own eyes is different she leaves behind her husband michael he wanted people to understand her dedication as a mother to her children and her job and their three young children we heard for him but obviously all of our concern is for the kids right now every decision that she made was for her children there will be a scholarship set up in Devonna's name for Scott County residents and students wishing to further their education in the emergency service career field. Devonna's funeral takes place Saturday morning. All right, Molly, thank you.